Hi guys, so this is going to be my February favorites. This month really went fast, obviously because it's only 28 days. Um, most of these favorites are Phoenix favorites. Uh, he has just been obsessed with in the past couple weeks. Um, I don't have too many of my favorites. So first off, this is kind of a me favorite because I love to read this book to Phoenix. He, um, it says I'm a big brother. It's definitely a book that I need to read to him as you can see has the pages. I kind of cut down the story a bit because it does have a lot of dialogue for his age. I cut it down. Just love showing him the pictures and just talking to him about becoming a big brother. I love anything that has to do with being a big brother. I'm trying to prepare him, you know, for situations like this where he has to share his toys and all that. And I just, I really, really like this book. I feel like I can try to start teaching him about being a big brother even though i think he's too young to fully understand like i said i read this to him and i just really enjoy it this was a gift from a friend of mine another book he has been enjoying this month on his own because he hates when i read to him it's really hard for me to really read to him um especially specific but books that he likes he takes them from me like this one he loves feeling all the ladybugs as you can see, they're like popped out of the page and he just loves that. He's had this book for a while and he just recently kind of really discovered um, that the ladybugs have like a texture and he loves feeling it because he loves the touch and feel book. So this to him is like pretty cool and he tries to like take them out and, you know, as they get less and less on each page. What we've been really loving this month is this Leapfrog Letter Factory and um, I've this was recommended on a video from the Dodge family and I bought it for Phoenix and at first I would play it for him and he never was interested in it like he wouldn't pay attention he'd keep playing or whatever um until recently that he I really noticed that it started catching his attention and the other day he actually said a letter that I had no clue that he knew and it had to be from from this and from a uh, other leapfrog things that says like the letters um and he loves the song i sing the song when it's not on and he just loves hearing it and i think it's a really good educational dvd if you have to put any dvd on we have definitely stopped watching mickey and took mickey totally off and kind of just watch this once or twice a day at most and he just actually absolutely loves it catches his attention now more because we don't watch mickey so this really catches attention and it sings throughout and it's just we have i loving this you really need to get this and um i got this one i believe at babies r us or toys r us section of babies r us um for i want to say 15 dollars or so so this month phoenix has been really into writing and drawing for the past few months actually and i found this in the dollar section at uh, Target, I believe it was three dollars, and it comes with some of these crayons in here, and you just color on it and then erase. So it's like a, it's kind of like a dry erase but with crayons, and it also came with this sharpener. So that's pretty cool. And I just leave the crayons in this bag and give him like one or two at a time, and he just loves coloring on it. He turns it around and colors on it as you can see. And I just grab a wipe, wipe it off when he's done and it, he can just continue using it and he loves it. I think all the little things around it help too and I'm starting to show him like oh this is the sun or this is a rainbow, this is the butterfly and he loves it. He just loves writing all over it. Also his coloring book as you can see has been his favorite thing also so the coloring book the only thing is that he like try he keeps switching pages trying to find like a cleaner page like when he sees this he doesn't want to color on it he goes to like a cleaner page and that was me trying to color with him but he didn't let me so he has definitely been loving anything to do with drawing even if i give him a pen and a piece of paper he just loves writing and just these things i think are just awesome this i got at a dollar store and like i said i got this at the Walmart um, Target and the crayons are also pretty cool because we got him these triangular ones which I took off the paper which was a big mistake on my part because he goes like this with his nail sometimes but these triangular ones were cool and he grabs them pretty well for for his age so 
and I keep them in a Ziploc just so that he doesn't get a hold of them. So recently, if you watch my vlogs, you've seen that Phoenix has been doing this puzzle on his own, and I think I have a few clips in it because we're just obsessed with the fact that he just sees the parts, he looks at it, and he matches it where it goes, and he has learned this literally from one day to the next. Like, he would take the pieces out and just toss them aside throw them around that's how he would play with them as much as I would sit with him and tell him okay put it here or put it here and try to teach him you know how you do a puzzle he loved playing with the puzzles but he wasn't playing with them you know to its full potential and if he tried to get the puzzle back in and it didn't fit he'd get furious and throw it and give up now he actually we take out all the pieces and he'll sit there he'll look at the piece look at the board and put it right in And I love that it makes the sounds because we also have a farm one that makes those sounds. He's not too fond of that one yet. This one is his absolute favorite. He loves it. He loves doing it. He has definitely mastered it, which is my favorite part. Seeing him do it and seeing his little mind work when he looks at the pieces and puts them where they go. And the fact that it makes the noises. So it's like he's learning that as well. And he gets so excited every time we cheer him on for for putting a piece in so i've definitely 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 have been loving this this one i believe was i got this one at kohl's i believe um i can't remember how much but it's a melissa and doug sound puzzle and these are very good and i love that it makes all the different sounds he has also been loving this melissa and doug train that he got um from my friend actually i think a few of these um of his favorites have been from the same friend and he has been loving this i had it on a higher up shelf and he asks me to bring it down for him every day all the time so now i have put it lower to his level and he just loves playing with it he loves that you know it comes apart like this and he just goes like this with this takes these out puts them down i try to teach him you know that the horse does with the the sound the goat does the pig and the cow takes them out plays with these by themselves he puts them back in and he absolutely loves this thing and the fact that it has wheels oh sometimes he'll just take the wheels and go like this he just can play with this little train for a long time and it's awesome and it is also a melissa and Doug, it's like Leapfrog and Melissa and Doug is like the the theme of this video. But I think they're both very, very good products and they make very good products. Um, Melissa and Doug's toys are very durable and I know this will last him a long time. And these little animals are very thick as you can see and just really good quality. Another thing Phoenix has been loving is this bag of big building blocks, First Builders Mega Blocks. He loves these. He cannot open the zipper yet himself, so he'll bring it over to me so that I can open it. And he'll just, um, he doesn't fully understand the concept of them as in linking them together to make something. He tosses them around and just plays with them. And it also has a little car in here. I don't know if you can see that you can build on. And he loves that part because he uses the car and just goes back and forth. And I'll build on it. And then he'll take it apart and we just play together. Like I said, he doesn't grasp the concept yet of really building. But he loves playing with these pieces and using them. And I got these at Walmart, I believe, around Christmas time. They were on sale for like $15. And I think it's definitely worth it something else phoenix has been loving food wise has been this yo toddler um strawberry banana yogurt i've only tried the strawberry banana one i haven't tried a different one he's really big on strawberry banana so that's why i tried this one but it's the yo toddler one normally i get him just regular yogurt and he loves it but i've tried these out and this one i just feel like it's so much better and it's so much thicker and juicier and kind of just like richer in flavor they taste really good and they have yo baby and yo toddler so it's certified organic no high fructose corn syrup no artificial flavors or sweeteners which is awesome and it's organic whole milk yogurt with fruit and cereal so i think this is just really really good i can't remember how much it is it came in a pack of six and i got it at target it's so far the only place i've I've gone to get it was at Target so I'm not sure where else they carry them. Okay the last two items are mommy favorites so I have been using this product on Phoenix's hair for just about a month now. I used it 
um, back then uh, went before we ever cut his hair but I bought it like a couple days and then we cut his hair so I've been using it now a friend of mine no his godmother <laughs> told me about it and um, it's called Mirta de Perlas <laughs> I said that so Americanized but it's really good it smells good it just I just use a tiny bit the reason that so much is missing is because I put it into another bottle a little pump bottle and I use like two pumps of it and it's really good and my my big thing is that it smells good and it's good for his hair it's not like too oily or anything like that so I got this one at CVS I believe and I've loved it so far I will probably be using it on baby girl as well if she has Phoenix's same hair and like I said I've had it for a while and be using it but I have a ton like literally everything that's missing is probably in the other bottle okay and for my last favorite is this tumbler cup I don't even know what it's called mason jar looking cup and I got this at party city for five dollars and I absolutely love this cup um, I wish it would have said like mommy or something else but that's the least of it I just love that it's plastic and I put my water in here and a whole bottle and some of water fits and I just find myself drinking it more often I don't know why we do that right when you have a cute cup you end up drinking more from it I don't know anyway and I love that the straw is attached and it doesn't come out and then it has the the cap which is awesome because Phoenix tips it over it doesn't really spill it could spill through there but you know what I mean and I just love it it's plastic and it's portable and it's big and and I absolutely love it and it's just so cute and they had a couple different ones I actually bought each of my friends won. They had different sayings like party and get wild and stuff. But it's whatever. And they're just cute. And I love it. I love the blue or the straw. And it was only $5 at Party City. Which was like a place I wouldn't have looked for something like this. So thank you guys so so much for watching our February favorites. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And let me know down below some of your kids favorites for this month or even mommy favorites. We're always looking for new things to try. So thanks for watching. Bye.